Hi, right, howdy folks. Um, back down at High Rock. Um, go ahead and try to catch some more of this crappy. So what I'm gonna do is that tree I ended up on the other night, I'm gonna go back up there and y'all y'all time looking for tips stuff. I'm gonna try to uh, show you how to dissect this tree laying down. Cause I fished it 10 or 15 minutes and caught a couple good ones on it. We're gonna go up there and break it down. And I'll show you how to do that. Stay tuned. Okay, you see this tree? You see the top of it up there? So the end of it's probably out in here somewhere cause it's a pretty big old tree. But I'm gonna start casting with the tree so I don't get hung up so much. So the limbs are probably coming out towards the lake. So I'm gonna cast up in here well, my finger cast on the outer sides then after I work all that then I'll go in in the center of it and I'll drop straight down into the tree and get in as much as I can and then see that dock over there? this is what I look around the dock to see the little crappy hurdles and stuff he got right in there Look for that kind of stuff too. But this tree is in between two docks and I'll fish both docks after I finish this tree. So I'm kind of in the shade right here. And when I got on the other day, it was in the sun good. So we'll see it now and then we'll check it this evening too. Okay, I caught one off of it. I know there's at least one there. <laughs> you see the tree right there. And I'm marking bait around it, the balls of bait. You can see them on your death finder. I'm throwing a little chartreuse today. Well, I started off with a little chartreuse. Let me get back up on it. Okay, I fished on the outside of it, the edges of it, caught one. Let's go to the middle of it now.
He's ripped off the end of it. Well, he'll eat. So stick with me. All right, now I'm all up in the tree. See, I done moved the boat up in the tree. I know it's going vertical. Try to vertical fish this without getting hung up so much. Caught a couple, three or four, no size. But I got some folks that work on it, a few. And I'm probably fishing, I'm in six, seven foot of water, I'm fishing about four and a half, five foot. Just dropping straight down. Spots, four, five, six seconds. I'll move on to the next. But I mostly try to keep my jig kind of still, like it's hovering there. Like I'm, you know, water temperature got up here was 51, 52. That's a little Patrick fish right there. You see what I'm doing? I'm just going from spot to spot. And this would be real good in the spring. But I caught up here the other day, so I figured I'd try. And again, it's in the shade. That's, I think that's why I need some sun on it. So we'll come back this afternoon. See if we can get into a mess up. I got the wind put it laid up right on top of the tree. The wind's just keeping me here on top of it. You see this? I'm all up in the middle of it. So I'll keep trying. Let me look behind you back here. See there's one back here behind you. See a crappy jig there. All right, stay tuned. Okay, let's try to hit some docks. Uh, I caught maybe six. I kept three in the live well, threw a couple back. I uh, lost a good fish in the brush. That's the only bad thing about when you hook a good fish, you got all that brush to wrap you in. So. Um, okay, tell me what you thought. It was kind of short and sweet there. I just wanted to diagram out how, how I go into and dissecting the tree that's laid down in the water. 
again the night the day before i really caught them down on the end of it we didn't do too good this morning uh the sun has a whole lot to do with it um that warms that water and that tree was in the shade and it was cold and the water was cold and so they just won't there. Didn't get a chance to go back that afternoon. I ended up finding some more stuff that was working and stayed on it. And you'll see that in a later episode. My next one, I'm going to go back to them docks. I crush them again on them docks. A couple, uh, I got a couple another two pounders. So can't wait for you to see those. But I did want to get this out and let you see how I dissect them trees. I hope it helps some. Um, again comment hit that thumbs up and subscribe to me so far i'm growing we're growing pretty good i thank everybody Crap.